Okay. Well, hey, we're down at time with Star 3 finishing once again in Grand Rapids, Michigan, 616-453-8309. You can check out our beautiful website at www.timelessartgr.com. Well, today we've got this beautiful little four-drawer chest here. Does it look pretty nice over there? It does. It's real, it looks real pretty. Yeah, this thing didn't look quite this it, nice when it came to us. It looked bad when it yeah, came to us. Yeah, it looked real bad. It? Yeah. It's pretty old. Maybe it's a nightstand or something. It is. It's a little nightstand. Oh. And it's very, very old. Um, and, well, anyhow, it was pretty rickety, so all the bottom down here was falling off. The drawers were falling apart. But anyhow, we uh, stripped it down, <laughs> sanded it up. We did our repairs before we sanded it. Um, I sealed it up. I usually never start by staining the wood. Once in a great while I do. I sealed it up. I took some Van Dyke Brown glaze and glazed it. And then after I sealed that and sanded it, I uh, gun shaded it to color. And it's pretty smooth right now. It's probably got about six coats of finish on it. And I am going to just demonstrate how I uh, apply my last couple coats of finish on here. It's Everything looks colored, looks good. I'm real happy with it. I'm going to start by removing the drawers. As I remove the drawers, it makes it easy uh, to get a nice, a nice clean finish going on. If I would have left the drawers in, I wouldn't be able to get up in here and it would look kind of like a, like somebody did a job that really didn't know what they should have done. Somebody did a job that really didn't take the time to do the job properly. So it just looks better doing this. You know, the back has color on it. Mm -hmm. So it just looks a little nicer for a customer when they get it. Um, so anyhow, there you go. So we got that. Hopefully the air compressor won't turn on and start making a bunch of noise. And then at that point, I take my drawers and I just set them right down here, just like that. I keep them all in the same direction. The cutout here sets over here. I space them out enough. So I can actually spray all the drawers.